But first, understand how Israel and history got wealthy. First, I'll start with the Bible. And in this, again, I'm not a teacher. I'm going to say these things and you're going to point to what you already know because you're already studying diligently and doing the work. But some things have been missed in the confusion of how to do it. The way it happened it was about 500 years before Christ, the Ashkenazi Jew in Genesis 10, you all know, migrated down and mixed in. This is the land of Ashka, the snake people are demon worshippers. These are the ones who went into the tribe of Levi. They weren't all corrupt. The top ones who had the whole village move were the corrupt ones. And the way Israel got wealthy, we'll see as this unfolds. And you're supposed to do the same thing today, not getting into Bitcoin. He says you have no heart in this world. And there is a way. It's the way that we've been doing it. And in three years, we got over $70,000 between about seven or eight people. Two hairdressers, a bartender, all low jobs, tip earners, 70 grand. Bought land, cleared it, put a road in, you name it. Now it's got power, electricity, generator power, solar, you name it. How do you do this? How did we do it? According to the word. So what's the word have to say on this? I've got to go back and see how these guys got rich today because they stole it from you. The black Hebrew Israelites. The black Hebrew Israelites. The black Hebrew Israelites. The black Hebrew Israelites. How did they do it? Well, they infiltrated in in Genesis 2. Not the, the picture of the town, innocent people. Let's call it the name of the city council. Warburgs, Rothschilds, Drexels, Ships. These guys went into the land of Judea and they went into the tribe of Levi. Three generations in, 300 years, they were predominant. They became the money changers. No more sacrifice for you guys. It was always personal sacrifice. Now they took it and now they're going to take your money and make you. And that's why Christ went and whipped them. The only time he used violence. Than of thieves. That's why when he said the truth will set you free in the verse to identify them, why have you come here, they said. He says, I have come to free you from your bondage. We are sons of Abraham. We have never been slaves at any time. Hmm, they were never in Egypt. So now through the generations on, we get that established. In 1100 AD, not a history lesson. In 1100 AD, they were ready to go down and try to take Jerusalem again. They were up in the area of Turkey. But just before they left, they, found, they knew that they heard the Vikings were coming down. 